Dear YouTube, I am leaving. I really need some help, dude. I really need help. Can you help me? With what? What do you, what do you I, It's just like, I feel like the intro of this vlog is going to be kind of boring if I just talk. So, do you have anything cool we could put in the you beginning know, of it? Come with me. Come, you have something? I have a really big surprise for you. Can I just hold the camera? Yeah, you can hold the camera. I'm just going to close your eyes. Um, this is, jump here, let me just, can I just, can I just blindfold you? All right, so just walk this way. Um, this is surprising my girlfriend with a huge mansion. Uh, come this way. No, <laughs> oh my no, God, seriously, walk. All right, there's a step. There's a step right here. Okay. Step, step, okay. Awesome. Awesome, great. I know you've been waiting for this for a couple of years. What is it? You're gonna and Phantom's gonna cry. bark. Uh, you can open your eyes now. I got you a pumpkin. Oh, you offer me? Yeah. The oh my god, dude. No, it's actually big. No, it's actually, it actually is big, but uh, morning, Phantom. Welcome back to another vlog. That's a big pumpkin, Jake. What are we supposed to do with a pumpkin that size? I don't know. Where do you, where does a young lad like yourself get a pumpkin this size? You know, man, I was in the streets of Woodbrook and you just, you just kind of came upon it and you, you copped it. How many pounds is it? It's like 69. It's heavy. Oh my god. This is father son goals right here. Oh, go Jake, go. Got a pumpkin, man. Go Jake, go. Transporting a giant pumpkin. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna manage. Just let me manage this and make sure everyone's doing their job correctly. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to another vlog. So I'm covering my mouth because I got something done to my teeth and my whole left side of my face is still numb. So if I'm talking funny, that is why. But I did film a little bit at the dentist, so we'll cut to that. I may or may not have gotten some new teeth. Oh my goodness, look at my tooth. Currently getting a new tooth. And it's whack. <laughs> what? My face is numb. Guys, I'm getting a new tooth. I know that's really gross, but it's gonna look good already. Okay, Tanner, are you getting a new tooth right here? Dang, too easy, too Very easy. Nice, right? You know what? No, no, no I don't want it. Don't want it. Dang it. So yeah, I actually have like a temporary crown on it right now, and then I got to get a new tooth because, as you guys know, this is all a fake tooth, and the crown I had before I didn't really like it. But anyways, we have a giant pumpkin. I'm at Jake's house, and we're bringing this up to Temecula to blow it up for Jake's channel. So we're gonna try to fit this in the car somehow. And Jake's car is still looking effed up a little bit. But by the way, guys, if you haven't seen that video a few days ago. I spray painted his car. Look at my look at my thing right there. I spray it's an eighty thousand dollar car and I spray painted it. Okay, so another really cool thing is Jake got it. Let me show us your tattoo. You you guys have seen Jake's tattoo, which is what? What does it's it mean? My mom's like date. She got diagnosed. And what did you get after Jake? I got his birthday. <laughs> oh. Like they have matching mother and son tattoos. That is gold. Hey little guy, you wake up from your nap. Oh, he's so cute. Oh my god. Oh, is, isn't he oh. precious? Pumpy, where is your seatbelt, young man? I thought we buckled you in. <laughs> oh my god, Jake, Jake, he's done it again. Okay, guys, so we just got to Temecula, and we're about to get food right now, but I wanted to help you guys. Jake, you need to stop vlogging. This is getting bad, all right? What is this whole thing we got going? Put the camera down, just put the camera down. Put the camera down. I need to talk to you. Just put the camera down, dude. It's not recording over yet. I just don't understand what your deal is lately. Like okay. honestly, like this is like serious. Like best friend to best friend. Like I went in your backyard, okay, without you asking. Yeah. And I saw two grills. One of them uh -huh. said your name on it because it was rightfully yours. Uh-huh. The other said a name that is not yours. So I just want to know what you are doing in the state of business about being up on people's grills that aren't yours. You know, no. it's just really been pissing me off lately. And like it's just disrespectful. I know the Fox one doesn't preach like you can't just come up in a grill like that. You know how no. grills are to people. Are you telling me that this isn't recording? Because to my eyes, this is recording, and if I'm on a prank show, I will sue. You're gonna have to sue me because you are, in fact, on a prank show. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Okay, so I just ran into some Fox fam, and you have a badge? Yeah. Are you a cop? No. He's gonna go up to him because Jake's changing outside and fully prank him, and I'm gonna try to film it. Oh my god. Oh my god, Jake is gonna be so scared. Oh no. So Jake just changed and literally got in his underwear in the parking lot, and he has a badge. Jake's face right now. Oh my god. What happened? Should I vlog it? What the heck? <laughs>
<laughs> my boy! Oh, dude, dude, I just, they were fans inside, and he said, should Don't I? Don't ever talk to me again! Oh. oh my god, what'd you say? I told him that he was an exposed exposure, changing his clothes. Do you realize my heart <laughs> fell to the floor? Bro, that was epic. <laughs> Literally in there, and he, and he showed me the badge, he's like, I'm gonna, he's like, I was gonna go up to him and say, uh, for public indecency, I'm like, oh my god, do it all. No, logic. because I had my underwear, and I like, made sure that my shirt didn't show anything, but I was like, I was like, I guess I could still be counted, and I just, was, <laughs> hey, and then I was in there, I was in there trying to be discreet, and I was like, Oh wait, I would probably come out anyways, and then I was like, oh should I film this? Oh my god, that was so good. We finally just made it down to the warehouse because where's Zay? We were supposed to go to Zay's house right now, but he was dirt biking and won't be home for a few hours So we came to the warehouse and we're hopping in the Sprinter van This is my first time in the Sprinter. First time? And we're going to pick up orders. We're going to pick up mass quantities of T-Fox brand clothing. Today? Yeah, you're gonna be the chauffeur. And this is gonna be cool because you guys get to see where we get us a lot of our stuff printed. Hey Jessica, so w w where's all the boxes we're picking up? Um, that's some of them. Oh, you mean the all, all of these in in there? Yeah, we're gonna put it in there. Oh no! Why did we come here, Jake? <laughs> Look at guys, this is all T Fox you know what this merch. Means. This is we all T Fox merch. This is all T Fox merch. This is still, this is still, this is still. You guys are absolutely killing the support on my brand and I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. It literally blows my mind that like, I see people in public when I'm just out and they have my brand on their clothes. So like, thank you guys for that. Like this is, this is insane. Me and Jake are also very tired because the past two days we went to bed at three and woke up at seven. I got signed up to help Jessica. Yeah, that's okay though, bro. Look at all this stuff. This is insane. So this is uh, one of many places we get our stuff printed at. They print in stuff over there. They got a big old machine, guys. This is behind the scenes of behind the scenes. I don't know if I can come in here, but I'm kind of gonna. Look at those giant machines. This is where they make probably, no, well, not this exact place, but this is uh, a place where they'd make probably any brand you guys wear. All right, I'm gonna go out here now because I don't know if I'm allowed to film in here, but we gotta load up all these boxes. Lance, she always taking them notes. Hey. Conference room, a day in the wolves. Last year, work, I was zerked up a zerk trying to figure out the man. Before we finish loading all the rest of this stuff, in this box, this is all the new tattoo stuff. So I get to show you guys this. I think six days early, if you guys haven't heard, we have a whole new line coming out on the 10th. The winner, we're doing a giveaway all month, and the winner gets their name tattooed on my friend's leg. So you're gonna see this in a second. I'm like, Woo! I'm getting paid for that. I'm getting paid for that. No. I'm getting paid for that. I'm getting paid for that. No. I'm getting paid for that. All of these hoes, they know me. I'll never go back. Jessica's back there somewhere. We just stole her. Just drive off? Should I just leave? Yeah, I've just leave. Let's go. Let's go to Arizona. Like, Bye, Jessica. <laughs> Drift this thing, bro. It's like 90 feet long. We're in trouble. Look at Jessica. No, we've been bad boys. Look at her face. You're late. I was late. Yes. You took too long. You took too long, so we left you. You're on a time trial, Jessica. Are you going on a hot date? Yeah, I have a few actually. I call this one the school pickup. Hello. We're just here to pick someone up from school. We booing in the cup, boy. We booing in the. Hey, how you doing? We're picking up Michaela from school. This is a wild school, guys. Hi. Bye. So many, so many errands later. We are back. All the boxes are inside. The sprinter van's there. The kids are picked up from school. Michaela, how was school? Good. 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 You learned some stuff. Kinda. Sounds like school. That's good though. Good thing you had a good day. So we just finished up a bunch of errands and now we are finally going to the place we came up to Temecula for in the first place. We're gonna go meet up with Zay. We were with him in Hawaii. You guys probably remember him. We met him probably a year ago. He's a super cool kid. If you have not, you're about to meet him. We're going over to his house. We got that massive pumpkin. Who's on the phone? Oh, it's actually Jessica. Oh, Jess but Jessica's right there. We almost just walked out the door and I didn't even show you guys the new tattoo stuff. So Jessica's bringing that in right now. If you guys are wondering why Jake's shirtless, we just fully unwrapped, unwrapped his M4. If you guys saw, we spray painted on it. It was like purple color shift. Now it's completely blue. So I'll show you guys that in one second. But Jessica's going to get the box and I get to show you guys the new line that's coming out on the 10th of this month. Before I show you guys all the new tattoo stuff, we also just dropped a brand new breast cancer awareness for October, we are donating 10% of the profits to charity for breast cancer awareness and to support breast cancer. So this is some of the stuff. We got the hat, like a nice pink camo. We got little keychains. We got wristbands. So if you guys want to support breast cancer awareness, uh, go check out the link in the description. You guys can actually buy this stuff right now. It will be available all month. And the moment we've all been waiting for. I, I have not seen these shirts in person. I've only seen like, like the samples on the 
the internet. Here we go. Oh man, oh, this is full reveal. This is a full reveal right now. This will all be available at 8 a.m. on the 10th of October. Okay, first shirt coming right out of the box. We got a collage of all the tattoos me and Dylan have. And look at that, look at, we've got the try on the side. And if you guys are curious why that's there, it's because I got a try on my side. And look, it matches. So if you wear it this way, it's the same place right there. Ooh. Shirt number two, we got a nice little blue. I haven't even seen this one yet. This was Jessica's personal favorite, so we're having a little bit of a contest. I need to get your guys' opinion. We have three new shirts coming out. Do you guys like this blue one better with all the logo kind of straight across the chest there? Or sorry, across the stomach? Or my personal favorite? I think mine's better. I didn't come up with this completely. Sure. It is inspired by like a logo design. It's all a collage of our tattoos and then T Fox brand is spelled out. Guys, I love the tenth of each month drop because like stuff like this, we can do it in like larger quantities and like kind of wear it and hype it up. Rather, we, we tried the week to week thing and it was just kind of stressful on everyone. But I'm so stoked. We're back to that every 10th of every month. We're going to have a new line coming out and I'm excited for it. Oh, it matches my shoes. Ooh, that's fire. I love this shirt. This is my favorite. Like, this is my new favorite shirt we have. There she is. Look at that pretty little All girl. All baby. I know we finally, like, it doesn't look like an ex-girlfriend got really, really mad at him. There he is. There he is. Hey buddy, how you doing, young lad? Gavin, oh, Gavin, no. We Bro, we need to hug, hug everyone. everyone. Hug here. Bro, what's, Whoa, Gucci? Let's go, what's Gucci? What's Gucci? Yo, there's new. more people. What yeah. Um, Jake's car is also very dirty, so I don't know how you guys are gonna fit in here. I am so sorry for the choppiness on today's vlog. Me and Jake have been in the sun all day today. We sat in the Sprinter van all day today while Jessica did a bunch of errands, and then yesterday I had a shoot all day long. So we were super exhausted all day, but we just went and jumped in a pool, cooled off a little bit, and I am with this dirt bike right here. And I'm also at Zay's house, and we have the giant pumpkin. Oh, this is obviously for Jake's channel, so I'm not gonna be covering a ton of this. Definitely gonna get some behind the scenes. I got you. I got you. Oh, Zay, yes, yes, yes. Scooter tricks over a pumpkin. Tricks over a pumpkin. Yo, go, 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 go. My boy Zay, you can scooter. What? You're a savage. Yo, gimme, give gimme. Give Let me try this. Okay. Okay. All right. Well. Woo! Dude, that's not my scooter, but. <laughs> Look at me, mom. I'm on one wheel, and it's on my front wheel, but I still go. Oh, you, you would have kept the combo going as you were. Ugh. Jake always ends up. What is you? Come on, Jake. I helped the whole way down, and he didn't, so we're taking turns. Oh, he's your taking turns. Yeah. I, see. I see. Okay, okay. I'm a strong boy. Where, where's the location and the membership right now? I got to give you guys a little spot check really quick. So we were underneath the bridge. It is very silent, very beautiful. The sun is just about to go over that mountain. Then it's gonna start getting dark. This is gonna be really, really exciting. I have attempted to blow up a pumpkin with Coca Mentos, and then I did baking soda and vinegar, but now we actually are doing a dry ice bomb. So the pumpkin should blow up. It's gonna be super fun. Uh, I wanna get your guys' opinion though. What do you think is gonna happen? Do you think it's gonna completely blow up, or do you think this thing is too big and way too thick for anything to happen? And maybe it will just like do a big, it'll just like burst, but like not actually like blow up okay look how thick this pumpkin is okay I cut a lot of it off but then you guys get the idea you have the the ready I heard we have the I we have water in like there kids do not try this at home this can be extremely dangerous Okay, we're running. We're running. <laughs> Currently running. All right. I don't know oh, how no. big the explosion will be. I don't know how this is gonna happen. That's it. That's it. I called it. We need a two liter. Okay, so I, I actually called that. Before. I thought that the pumpkin would be too strong to actually blow up. Instant replay on that. Jake. That's the only right. way we're gonna get this is if we go buy a two liter. And if you want yeah. it to explode, explode. So that being said, not it. I kind of want it to explode. Okay, yeah, I definitely need it to explode. Yeah. A few moments later. He's gonna die right now, ready? Back up, back up. Back Three, up, dude. two, one. Cash, back Cash, up. Don't do that. Cash, this is back up, dude. This. What are you doing? All right, take two. I'm gonna run back. What happened was he didn't screw on the cap enough, so hopefully this one actually blows Just up. Next. Put it in. Put it in. Put it in. Yeah, yeah a nice lid job on that one. Everyone's being a little negative. Tanner's just gonna get a good angle. Have a positive attitude. We're just gonna see what happens. One eternity later. Oh, well, it finally happened, guys, but we had to use a different substance, but we did it successful. successful. Oh, man.
Alright guys, so there's been something that I've been meaning to talk to you guys about and today's vlog was super jumpy but I'm back at my house and I'm actually about to go to bed because I'm super tired but there's something that I need to talk to you guys about. Dear YouTube, I am leaving to go to Florida tomorrow. Come on, you guys knew that. I told you that like two days ago. I have been out for the past two days like every single day getting like four hours of sleep. I'm exhausted but tomorrow I am leaving San Diego. I know that was a little, I, I tricked you a little bit, it's a play on words. But um, no, I am leaving San Diego tomorrow morning to go to Florida to hang out with Adam LZ for three days and I'm bringing Maverick Leonard with me. So that is gonna be so fun. Today's vlog, I know it was kind of super jumpy, but like I said, we've been really tired all day and kind of tried our best filming. And then when we went up to the warehouse, we didn't do a whole lot, but I tried to make it awesome for you guys. So hopefully today's vlog put a smile on your face. If it did, drop a thumbs up on this video. Subscribe if you are new. That is gonna do it for today's vlog. Vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you look forward to me leaving San Diego to go see Adam LZ. I have never been to his new house. The last time I was in Florida was with Adam LZ and it was the first time we ever met, which was February of 2016. And I think I had 200,000 subscribers. And now Adam has a new house, a new skate park in his backyard, crazy cars, all this cool stuff. And I can't wait to go there. So get really guys, look, look forward to that. We're going to be making some super awesome vlogs. Anyways, peace out. Let's roll the outro. I wish you were so